Well, here's a photograph of the plane when it's finished. You can see we got our landing gear wheels already installed here. And we got our wing strut. Finished that up last week. Take a look under here. Got our air brake. It's all hinged, installed. Just got to hook up some cables. And the cockpit area here. Got my fuel select valve already uh, hooked up. And we got our wiring ran already. So we just need to finish the other half of the wing here and then we're going to install them in the next little segment. Alright. Alright, what we got here is we went and got our hydraulic brake line hose here and we need to uh, install the hydraulic brake lines. We gotta run this hose up here. Yeah, sure, I need a little more room here. All right, we're through here. Just need to pull that up and through. Need to run separate lines because each caliper has its own brake pedal. We're gonna need about six feet and have a lot left over. I got my channel through there so I put my brake line I gave a little bit of thought and I put a bunch of McDonald's straws together and uh, taped them to my strut in the beginning or before my fiberglass and so made a nice little uh, thing it'll go through there I just need to bring it up here a little bit leave a little overhang and then we'll teat in the middle and we'll run that up to the fuselage and then uh We'll be pretty much good there. Well, we're waiting on the UPS guy today. He's supposed to be bringing my front landing gear for the, the plane. And, uh, well, I've got a bunch of parts coming from UPS. It says it takes time to get them, I guess. We're going to get some interior seats in here this week. Finish shipping up uh, the brake lines. We get that all ran, and then I got 16 wires to run, and we'll be good to go. All right, what we're gonna do here is get the ring ready, ready to uh, install. Ooh, you can see its length there. And we're just waiting on Darwin to get back from uh, the hardware store. And uh, we'll be ready to go here in just a little bit.